This isn't a video that I want to do at all, but I think it's my responsibility to do it because I don't see enough people outraged by this subject matter for this target LGBTQ fiasco. And to be honest with you, if I didn't have a kid, I probably wouldn't care. All right. But my son has to live in this world. So when I walk through Target, when we turn on his video games, when we go see his favorite movies, we consistently see LGBTQ propaganda pushed in the front. I remember we went to the movies um, a couple months ago. There were four LGBTQ like commercials before the movie started. And I'm like, what the hell does this have to do with a Disney movie? What does that got to do with anything? So it's been something that's been on my mind for quite some time, you know, and this subject matter really gets me really, really upset, to be honest with you, because I just think that there's a lot of dudes out here that look for the approval of women and they're afraid to speak up about it because shaming has become such a powerful thing where somebody can throw phobia on you or hit you with some sort of shaming tactic that men are cowering out to. I, I don't know if I said that right, but a lot of dudes are pussy. That's basically what I'm saying. And I'm, I'm for boycotting any company that is pushing a narrative on children and gullible adults are even following this, you know, like oh, all of a sudden you're 30 and you're, and you, and you, and you believe in all of this. I mean, I'm seeing stuff in my Instagram feed where a woman had a brand new baby and she had a, uh, she had a bunch of LGBTQ stuff on it saying, I got a gay baby. We're going to have a gay baby. It's a viral clip. I'm not going to share it here, but I've seen stuff like that a million times. And I, while I don't hate anyone, I don't have hatred in my heart for anyone. It's not the type of person I am, but I believe in the nuclear family. I believe in God, man, woman, child. I believe that is the perfect balance I believe that's natural. I believe that's normal. So much so that I've been watching more conservative content than, and I've been voting Democrat most of my life. Most of my life, but it's getting ridiculous. It's getting ridiculous. And while I'm not a big fan of, 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 of saying I'm a Democrat or Republican, because I believe when you do that, you get too tribal. And then anything that you, everything they want to do, now you're for it because you just want your team to win. And then humans get lost in that crazy crap. So I like to, to vote for what I think is right. But in this case, I'm sorry, I went on a tangent. In this case, I feel like I have to say something because like I said, I have a son and I'm consistently seeing these narratives pushed on him and everything that he enjoys. And um, yeah, we're going to get into this video. By the way, I'm not the type of person to carry hatred in my heart for any human being. Okay. I believe that if you want to, if you're a dude and you want to be in love with a dude and y'all want to be together, that's fine. If you're a girl and you want to be with a girl or vice versa. Okay. If you want to wear women's clothing or, or if a woman wants to wear men's clothing, that stuff is all right with me. I think that you should be able to do that. Okay. However, I am not a fan of, a agenda of the LGBTQ consistently pushing that narrative on children and on society. Okay. As though that is natural. Okay. If it's natural, then you wouldn't have to push the agenda. You wouldn't have to push the agenda. Okay. And it's just getting to the point now where I see so much of that everywhere, everywhere I go. I mean, you can't unsee it. And at first I thought that I was just tripping that like, maybe I'm just, overthinking things and then I see it in everything I see it in everything and it's like and then and I see that other people don't notice it it's crazy but anyways let's get into this video let's go beat is rough Yeah, they target and target, target, yeah, they target kids. Target, target, yeah, they target and target, target, yeah, they target. All right, right.
right off the bat, the intro is fire. The rap cadence is, is catchy. They're making it fun, but it's a serious subject matter um, to a lot of people. And, um, yeah, this is um, a fire track so far. Target, target, yeah, they target and target, target, yeah, they target kids. Target, target, yeah, they target and target, target, yeah, they target kids. You know they targets that wrong, trying to play with the kids. It's the mayor of Megaville, I'm preaching again. You know the LGBTQ don't went too far. You know they cutting these kids, they leaving trannies with scars. Pushing the gender, promoting sexual genders. I'm only rocking with Bruce, don't rock with no Caitlyn Jenner. You think oh. that gay shit gon' get you paid? Yeah, we gon' see. It's my Lago 20, it's one if we trumpin', baby. Fire. Hey, he went in, I like him. Back, but they targeting your kids. They don't even need to ask, cause you all know what it is. Yeah, that's why I keep a strap. And I'm always by my bears. This agenda gotta stop. Yeah, you know we gonna win when they target, target. Yeah, they target in. The crazy part is they shot this at Target. And it's, I mean, just look at all this stuff. It's crazy. Target, yeah, they Target and Target, Target, yeah, they Target kids. Have you heard the news story, Target, Target and kids. They going after our youth, and yeah, they do it like this. If you ain't mad yet, well, then you better be pissed. Let's protest until they close and they ain't gonna be missed. Why they got pride shirts in the kids' clothing section? Why they trying to mess with the kids and give misconceptions? They manipulate I mean, like, it's a sexuality movement. One thing I don't understand is how people turn their brains off. Like, I don't understand how a grown man can be at a parade wearing nothing but a sock, walking past like a seven-year-old girl with a bunch of LGBTQ, LGBTQ uh, uh, paraphernalia on. And what what circumstance would that be okay where people can just be vulgar in the streets um, and we just turn a blind eye because nobody wants to be shamed. Oh, you're, you're, you're homophobic. Oh my God. You know what I mean? It's a, that's not the case. All right. Like even as a heterosexual man, I can't walk in Popeye's butt naked, you know, and order something, you know, because it's, because it, <laughs> unless, <laughs> unless the parade is going on, that's the only time that's allowed. It's, it doesn't make sense to me. Where did this dude come from with the R&B? Talking now by time they teens got depression. We need a plea up on every island side. They start saying resides. Wash it with the blood of Christ. It's needed here, so we don't think twice. They think with a Satanist. We don't know this is the end. God is coming for revenge. I was fired. Oh, Target is targeting my kids. Really good voice. But they targeting your kids. They don't even need to ask. Cause you all know what it is. Yeah, that's why I keep a strap. And I'm always by my bed. What's the Tampax for? I don't get it. That was a incredible track. I loved it. Fun, catchy, with a serious message that I'm pretty sure is important to a lot of people, including myself. And let me make something abundantly clear. I don't like the idea of something happening to someone based off of their preference or what they choose to view themselves as. What I am against is it being pushed and promoted to children, okay, who aren't even old enough to make any decisions or even their, their brain, their brains aren't even fully developed yet. And it's like they're, they're being socialized and to, 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 to think one way and to support a specific lifestyle over another. Okay. Over what is natural to most people on earth on planet earth. Okay. That's what I mean. So it's, it's not, this isn't intended to be any, any sort of hatred. Okay. I know it's going to get taken that way, but, um, but overall, the track was really dope, and uh, I think they should make more music like this. If you like content like this, please be sure to let me know that. Let me know you want to see more 
controversial content on this channel by liking the video. Subscribe. Um, you guys keep my channel afloat. The supporters out there uh, that buy me a coffee with the link in the description or the ones that check out my Patreon and hit me up directly. I respond to everyone. You can also catch content on there that doesn't make my YouTube channel. I appreciate you guys for kicking it with me today. Peace.